Headline Starlight. DJ Star. Yeah, all that's getting recorded right now, so. Well, we back. Season two of the Cal Podcast. Uh, getting this thing the month of July popping off. We just got done with celebrating Pride Month in the month of June with all the LGBTQ people. Uh, we was trying to get Sue Cousin, who is a transgender on, but um, he, uh, I think he's somewhere having way too much fun and we didn't want to interrupt that. So hopefully we can get him on at the end of the month, the beginning of uh, August. But we're going to continue rolling on with our Alpha Beta Male series. Quita and Pert uh, should be getting on shortly. Y'all know how they is. Quita, we don't know what she's doing. And Perk, I mean, he could be doing something, cute stuff, whatever. He old. But we got a special person back on the Cal Podcast. As y'all know, she's my favorite auntie of all time. And she came to help us out with our Alpha Beta Mega, or Alpha Beta Male series. And she's going to give her advice. So y'all, welcome back to the Cal Podcast. My aunt, Auntie <laughs> Keita. Lord, okay. Welcome back, Auntie. Hey. Yeah. Auntie. So how? So so how life has been since the last time we talked? Amazing, amazing. No complaints. Um, glad the school year is over with. Um, even though I'm teaching summer school, but. I don't know whose bright idea that was for me to do that. Next time I say I'm teaching summer school, go ahead and cuss me out. Well, other than no, that, life is great. Uh, are you involved in any hot girl summer activities? It's a little warm, a little warm this summer. Okay. For those I had, I had um, to tone it down. Oh, Kia, uh, she has a boo. Well, she, she been had a boo. But that they ain't got real serious. I'm so happy for her. And she's on her hot girl thought girl shit. Don't let her vo- don't let her fool you. As you can see from the braids, she getting it in. Coach uh Make the Stallion will be proud. <laughs> I can't with you, man. So, I can't. I'm, I'm calling I'm calling all you teachers out who uh uh participating in this hot girl thought girl summer. Like it's mostly teachers. It ain't the ones who you thought would be doing it because well, if they we don't doing get it, the point we of hot girl, it. thought girl. If we doing it, we deserve it because this 2020, 2021 yeah. academic school year was one for the books. If you survived it, hats off to you. Kudos to you. It's been a rough one. Yeah, but they don't they don't understand they don't understand the hot girl thought girl summer. You see, May said, <laughs> excuse me, you be on your hot girl thought girl summer, but you go home to your man. Exactly. And a lot That's of girls got, more. and a lot of women got, they got confused with that. So they're like, do I go home to a man or do I go home to my man or do I go home to the man? And they just didn't get it. So they just, I had been a hot girl. Well, I go home to mine. So I know, cause you know the rules. Make, make coach, make the style. You'll be proud of you. I can't with you. So kudos mm-hmm. to you, but we ain't gonna hold our time. We're going to, I'm going uh, to play a quick video, and then we're going to go from there. And because, you know, uh, not shit, whatever. As you know, uh, she, like she said, she is a teacher, so she got to wake up and go teach the kids. Um, so let me go ahead and play this video. And we'll go from there. I wanted to switch gears a little bit. The beta male and the alpha male. Some of you women got this really messed up. A beta male is just a personality type that is not as strong or out or not as uh, outgoing and aggressive and assertive as an alpha. But that person is still a man. The beta male is the male that's going to take care of you. He's going to worship you. He's going to please you. That's his whole agenda. That alpha male, you don't please him. And he's only going to please a lioness. And half of y'all out there ain't a lioness. So a lot of you out here that was designed for a beta to 
protect you and to cater to your crazy ass. You don't want him because you think he's too soft. But you want to go over there with the king of the jungle like he going to take your shit. Ain't no alpha male taking no shit from nobody unless you a lioness. The jungle don't lie. So, Quita, auntie, my favorite aunt. How do you feel about what this uh, young lady just talked about? Because it got a lot of retweets, a lot of quotes, but what is your opinion? My opinion, I agree 100% with what she's saying. I'm that female, I agree 100% with what she's saying. I mean, some females, they put themselves in these positions. Um, they, like for instance, you go after a beta male with unrealistic expectations. That's just like case in point, say I'm going after a no good nigga. I'm going after this man, no good. He's known for being no good. Um, got a track history. I mean, all the signs are there. I know he ain't shit. But I get with him knowing he's like this and expecting him to treat me like a queen, lay out the roses for me, be faithful and everything. That's me having unrealistic expectations. I know he ain't shit, but I still chose to go and be with him. So that's just like why I would a female that knows she has the personality that she's going to clash with that beta male. Like, I mean, like that alpha male, why would you go for that? You setting yourself up for failure. Okay. So could you said, um, okay, I'm going to just keep it with alpha male. So could you have that same expectation for somebody who you know is not an alpha male? Even though he might be a no good nigga too as well? Could I have those same expectations for someone who's an alpha male? Who's not an alpha male. Who's not an alpha male? I mean... Now, because you said if you know this nigga ain't shit and you go in there with all that... I was using that as a scenario. I'm not saying I'm that just, all alpha males aren't shit. I'm not saying that. I'm No, I'm keeping the same scenario. I, I, I mean, I know where you're coming from. Remember, she, she has a man, hot girl, thought girl, summer. But could you have that same expectation for somebody who's not an alpha male? Or is just always just alpha males? I, I mean, it's go, it goes both ways. I mean, why would you, like, how, okay, how can I put this? So basically, you going... My personality, I know how I am. I am very outspoken, mm -hmm. but I'm the type of female, I'm going to let a man be a man. Right. That alpha male, that, that that doesn't phase me, but you have those females who are very outspoken and they tr they want to trump the alpha male. An alpha male is not going to let you do that to them. You're not going to be able to talk to an alpha male any type of way. I'm a woman, I'm very outspoken, but I let a man be a man. But you have those females who get who say, oh, I need this alpha male. Um, he the only one that can, he's the only one that understands me or he can control me. But when you get with him, when he puts your ass in your place, now that's a problem. Mm -hmm. You can't expect so, him to be a beta male, right? So I... I never dated no males before, so I don't. Know. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> I couldn't. I, I can't. I can't. I can't help you. I'm sorry. I but wish no, I could. Do you understand what I'm saying? I, I do. I do. I really do. I do. So let me ask you a question. Have you ever? I, uh, let me, I know you have, but what? Which one do you think you have been most consistent with? Because I know you dated alpha males, and I know you have dated beta males, but which one have you been the most consistent with? That the relationship went the longest. Alpha. Hello. Hey, how you doing? Hey, Snapchat. You remember my aunt, right? I do. I'm not your okay. Wait, wait. Don't listen to her. Wait. Well, let me let me wait, let me catch you up, Quita. Uh, first of all, the relationship that she was in has blossomed to something great. Okay, we're getting time. married. Almost, yeah. but pregnancy might come first. Let me tell you what happened. Listen, listen, Peter, this is what happened. The Key Sweat and Bobby Brown versus, they was in the same room and 
the I ain't gonna go into details about the text message we were having, but I'm still waiting for the pregnant test results. But anyway, she is participating in the hot girl, thought girl summer, and she's having a ball. Is that what we're doing this summer? Yes, because you don't she she don't know the rules. Who doesn't know the rules? Quita. She don't know the rules of hot girl, thought girl, summer. Because Coach made the no. study and said, you can be a hot girl and a thought, but just make sure you go home to your man. Okay. <laughs> so, Coach <laughs> made Coach, So, Coach you made, go out, get turned up all day, on. get liquored up. Come on now. benefits. No, 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 no. Not just that. You wear your nasty outfits, the short shorts, the one pieces, the two pieces. You let it all hang out. You twerk. You do everything. But then you go home to your man. Go home to the man. I can't. Go home to your man. And I always always come home to the man. Yeah, but now some of these girls don't get that because they used to just being a thought girl and ain't got the man to go home to. So they just struggling. But my aunt know the rules. So, anyways, back to uh, 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 my aunt. So, alpha males, you have had the, the most successful with. Yes. Why not? Why not a beta? Why not beta? Because of my strong personality, I tend to mm. lose interest quickly. Mm. I don't want a yes man. And you tend to get that with beta males. It's always, yes, baby, this, yes. Somebody need to, all right, kiddo, chill out, sit your ass down some more. Hmm. I don't want nobody. I just run all over. I can't do that. Because we arguing, you know I got a slick mouth, and I'll be like, your bitch ass. Like, I don't like. Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> we ain't going to hold her too much because she's a teacher as well. So, you know. So, but, but anyway. they just, I just, I, I haven't, like, I get turned off quickly. And I lose interest. Like, okay. So let me ask you this question, since, since, since uh-huh. you're my favorite honey, you know a lot of it. What am I? Because I'm going to know, you know, because I, I already know what I am. What, mm. what do you think you are? Wait, okay, go ahead. Answer. Yeah, I was going to ask him that. What do you think you are? I'm a beta. Okay, because I was gonna say the same thing. Yeah, I mean, you are. I'm a baby. Because once you go crazy, all right, go ahead. Yeah, you're not. Whatever. You're not gonna go back. You're not finna just. Mm-mm. Yeah, you. Nah, I ain't got time for that. No, nah, no. Nah. All right, you're right. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like, mm-hmm. I'm. I mean, I just don't. Betas, they're nice, but. As far as me being com- compatible with them, I've dated betas before, and it was just I, I've lost interest. Like, I don't need any. What about you? What am I interested in? I mean, what, well, not uh, what you're interested in. What have, what have you had the best relationship with, alpha or beta? Uh, I don't do well with alpha. I'm too rebellious. She is too. Like I don't do well with with alphas at all, cause I'm an alpha. So betas are probably best for me. <laughs> cause I like that. Hey, you way. said I'm rebellious. That's what Florida said. He said you're rebellious. I know well, I'm. Rebellious. Why would you say that? I'm very rebellious. <laughs> You just lick it like <laughs> I want to know. So, so you, you don't feel like you're rebellious? I don't. I don't <laughs> because I have my because I have my own opinion that makes me rebellious. No, it doesn't. The things that we do make us rebellious. So that's why I want to like. Why do you? Why does? He, why do you, sir, think that I'm rebellious? Please tell me. <laughs> Over the damn glasses. I can't with you. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I, I'm straight with my answer. 
I told you what I was. You, you, re you really don't think you're rebellious? I really don't. Where's the Where's the Alpha Q? He he. Um, I don't know. I know all. I know he went to oh. Mississippi and he is re reliving his wild oats in Mississippi. So in hotel, he might be killing a boar right now. So we haven't talked to him since he's gone to Mississippi. Yeah, but we'll deal with that later. We 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 we'll, we'll, we'll let him be. We he's, haven't he's even checked out him. Like, he I right, he in Mississippi. Ain't nothing happening. Him going to him going to Mississippi is like us going to Disney World. It's a uh, fun place. Lies. <laughs> okay, have you have, hold on? Have you heard from? I have heard you from. Him. He has a face. Finna FaceTime. Have you heard from him? Have you heard from him? So if why you was at Disney World, would you be FaceTiming somebody? If you yeah, was at I Disney World answer. right now. Yeah, I'll but would answer. you FaceTime? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But would you FaceTime somebody if you're at Disney World? Probably not. Thank We're going to FaceTime his ass right now. Okay, anyways. So, get back back to all that anyways before we get off rule with the light skin guy. Um, <laughs> Re re rebellious. Um, it's not because you have your own opinion. It just certain stuff ain't finna go down with you. So that's uh, what most females. How can, how can I? No, oh, no, 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 no. She, she's rebellious. Come on, tell me, please. Well, it, I'm trying not to go into details of what I know. <laughs> so, um, yeah, like I, 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 well, I give you one point of example. When you want to, um, uh, want to do something, you do it. Like most people might consider. Well, let me say not most people. Most women might consider. Okay, maybe I should just wait. And see, when you're ready to do something, you do it. You leave. You go on trips. You go on by. That's me being rebellious. That's, like, that's just me living my life. I'm not asking, can I go? No, it's not. It's not that you're just living your. It's not that you're just living your life. It's just when, you, when you want something, you don't wait. Okay, so. I mean, since we've been friends, you haven't really seen me in a serious relationship. So, like, now, my relationship now, like, when I go out of town, I run it by him. He's cool with it. Exactly. Wait, wait, he's wait. hold on. Because you, you, sound, you sound like me, because when you run it by him, are you asking or you're letting him know? I'm letting him know. No, okay. She, she let him know. She let him okay. know. She let him know. She let him know. She let him know. Okay, so what if he says he doesn't want you to go? We have not ran into that issue yet. Um, oh, okay, <laughs> and if he says he don't want you to go, then what happens? So I'm going to need to know why. <laughs> um, wh what was the reason? See, see, okay. Now, if you can give me a valid reason, yeah, wait, but, I will rethink my trip and be like, okay, look, I don't need to cause any problems with my relationship. So I'm gonna sit this one out, y'all. Okay. If you, if you can't give me a valid reason, I'll see you when I get back. Is that being rebellious? Okay, so hmm. it is if you say you can't go. Well, but you, but you know, that doesn't count because we haven't ran into that issue yet. <laughs> Yeah, and we and we and we and right now we got some special going on. I think there's a baby in the work. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just. Did you stop wishing pregnancy on my life? Um, I think once you get pregnant, things will start to work out in life for you better. Cause she'll be no. a great mother. Pregnancy doesn't make yeah. things better. How long so have we been knowing each other? He's been wishing pregnancy on my life since we've met. She oh no, no, I you, thought you were pregnant. That, 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 no. no, there was a point in her life. No, there was a point in her life where the leopard bra was just taking over her life. <laughs> What's that? 
Hey, go perk. We on the alpha. We on the alpha beta. We on the alpha beta. Uh, uh, Let me see them eyes, eyes, boy. And look at Quito, just being a guy. What happened with the alpha beta? It's the milk. It's the milk. (laughs) So. Go, hold on, let me hold on. Let's just take a moment. Go ahead, Quita. Just go ahead and be mesmerized by Perk because she's been waiting to see you for the longest. Go ahead. Yeah, she's been waiting to see me. <laughs> hey, yeah. Oh my god. We ain't seen, we ain't seen Perk in take, two bro. weeks. All right. You know. Wait, it was, you, uh, wait. It was fun in a lot of places. See, now look at her. She all <laughs> sitting up and everything. Mm-hmm. Hey, hey, Miss McKay, how you doing? Hey, how you doing? Oh, don't worry about Florida. He he trying to get everybody pregnant because he want to get pregnant. Oh well. <laughs> Look, let me clarify that. We both trying to get somebody pregnant by the end of the year. Oh yeah. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm trying to go to fam you and leave some. No. Wow, you got to be careful and tally. Okay. Uh-oh. Never mind. He ain't tell me. Take your rubbers with you. Yeah, be careful. Take your rubbers. Coming so from a Floridian. Let me tell you. It's called what? I said coming from a Floridian. Be careful in tally. Okay, so mm. let me say something. It's tough. We got a rule about condoms. <laughs> what would you like to share? I'm drinking. Oh, you, uh, what you drink? No, no, oh. don't let him. Don't let him. I know oh. he's gonna drink. So, where is he? Drinking? His ass. This is a bourbon. party cup. Bourbon. That's what I do for you. That ain't no right. damn bourbon. Look like Pepsi to me. Look like Coke because it got too much acid in it. That's the chance. It's a Pepsi or a Coke. Let his ass say because he always skip out on questions because he ain't answered the eating ass question yet. <laughs> Answer the question. He already told you. You you be looking for a direct. No, no, he be he, he blurs it he out. Quita, why do you keep asking he, that question? The man he said it he out. learned from young Nick and Young. What do you, what else do you need? No, he won't say it on on the actual podcast. The he top, always blurred out. Top, he the, said that on on the podcast. The topic you ain't watched the episodes with our special guest, who is my favorite aunt. Was participating in Hot Girl, Thought Girl Summer. It's about Alpha and Beta. So far, you answer that question though. No, you can answer it. I'm gonna do it after the uh, ETA question. I been answered that. Okay. We, On the we podcast. I said have you let it? Pl- have you let it play? On the Did podcast. Did you let it play? Yeah. Yes. yes. Uh, you're. He's such a liar. He's such a liar. I'll send it to you, Bert. No, the YouTube. point about Nick and, and Young, he said it on it. Matter of fact, it's the episode on them. It's on YouTube. It's on the episode. That's how I know he said it. It's I'm on YouTube. It it's on because it was technical right technical difficulties. It was technical <laughs> difficulties, but it was on YouTube. But anyway, <laughs> back to the, the uh, alpha beta. No, what, what other question you talking about, Perk? Oh, about the condoms. Bring the condoms. Oh, I mean, you can answer that. I think they probably already. I mean, that's they, my don't aunt. they don't know. She do. Your aunt know? Yeah, we, I mean, it's my aunt. We talk a lot. Uh, you know the question. You know the the, the rule about the condom. Mm-mm. Mm. Oh, well, okay. we had that conversation. Hey, right. No, nah, we good. We keep it moving. Oh, you ain't gonna tell you that? I mean, she'll figure it out sooner or later. What's uh, the rule about condom, boy? She jump, she she hop on her toes real fast. They ain't not gonna get past us too soon. <laughs> now, Quita, we could play this alone probably for another two months. But anyway, back to the alpha beta male. Thank you. Uh, uh Perk. What's that about? You know, I'm I'm about that alpha beta stuff. So she uh uh my aunt says she um she has to date alphas. Beta, she will run over. Quita. That's what betas are though. <laughs> I mean, so, so how did I get to this, or was this about the? Uh, the I played girl? the video. I played the video. I played the okay, video. So you played the video, the one I sent you. Yeah. Okay. So, 
I mean, that's the thing about the beta. The beta is a good dude, period. <laughs> like, it's not a bad dude. It's just a dude that is good who who likes to who 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 is a leader but wants to lead to be to make the women happy not to lead and be like a protector in us in kind of a sort of way so the beta is not that it's just like some women want want an alpha but they don't really want an alpha they really want a beta so they want to say that they have an alpha but they don't really want to to be around the alpha because most times they're running alpha, they're gonna say, oh, he's too mean. Um, he's being um he's not being sensitive to my needs and all that. That's not what the alpha is. No. Mm -hmm. So an alpha and, and and like she said, the alpha has to be like most people say, oh, they they rude or whatever, but when when an alpha male finds his his uh and as she explained his line is, oh, he's a different dude. I ain't gonna lie to you. Very different. Very different. I'm talking about real, like can be can be an a hole, but definitely can be sensitive though. Well, Quita says she can't date alpha. She have to date betas. Yeah, she do. I agree. Why? Why? You don't want no alpha. You don't want about you. I mean, a lot of women say they they want like, and let me say this: people in general say that they want somebody to be real with them until real shows up. When real shows up, they walk out the room. Mm -hmm. So if you can't take real, period, then you definitely can't take a man being real with you because, and me and my mom had this conversation the other day and she was like, well, you can, you can be honest, but you don't have to be brutal honest. When you're being real about your feelings, you have to be real about your feelings. There is no extent or level to your realness when you're talking about your feelings, about your pain, about your hurt. So when you're talking to someone and you're entwined with them, like, like I say this before, me, Star, Florida, and Pat, women has to be okay with our relationship because we're brutally honest. Like when Star passed, I promise you 10 minutes after they put him in the ground and we went somewhere, it was a joke flashed already about him being in the ground. And only we could laugh at that and nobody could. So it'd be like, oh, y'all dirty as hell. No, that's just us. Like if, if it had been one of us and it was starting the other and he did the same thing, like that's just our relationship. I ain't saying everybody has to take on that relationship. That's just who fits us. And you're going to have to be, you're going to have to be a woman who can stand on her own and take it and talk noise back and not be so sent. Oh yeah, they, they too mean. They 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 talking about everything. Yeah, we're gonna talk about everything. And you better not cry. <laughs> this ain't the race for you, man. I'm sorry. I mean, Florida done broke up probably two or three of my relationships by itself. <laughs> I'm proud of myself. I'm proud of myself. I'm proud of myself. And that's the point. That's he probably terrible. Of... No, so you feel like I, I can't be with an alpha because I can't take you real. You can't be with alpha because you can't be with the alpha. It, it ain't nothing else to it. <laughs> it ain't nothing else to it. <laughs> you don't want to so be. So far, you wouldn't date? Okay. Huh? You said You're what? Right. I don't. I don't. I would say, so you wouldn't date me? I mean, I would date you just to say I'm dating you, but I wouldn't say we together. <laughs> <laughs> You don't, want, you don't want to be led. <laughs> you like to <the> lead. <laughs> and see, okay. the thing about an alpha female is she can be submissive, but she also knows no when to show her fangs too, though. Because she going to let him know, like, nigga, I'm only letting you do this because I want to let you do this, but I can run this show without you. <laughs> Oh, this this is our topic now. I'm I'm just in the background. <laughs> do do I really act like this? Like, is it that obvious? If you gotta ask that question, you know it's obvious. It can't like God dog, bro. You, know, you remember yeah, that? Like, damn. You know, sometimes when you be like, every dude is an issue with every dude. Like I, all these dudes, you done dated five dudes, all the dudes at the same time. Sometimes you just gotta look in the mirror at yourself. Sometimes it's you. It ain't them. It's you. 
as he mm-hmm. eats ice cream. Mm-hmm. Is that what he eat? I thought he was eating cereal. Mm-mm. I can't do milk. I've been having cereal. I'd have been doing this if I was eating cereal. That's low tax and tolerant ice cream. Nah, it's custard. Man, it's so much smoother than regular ice cream. I don't eat regular ice cream no more. They said that it is. Man, look, it is. Now, ice cream, now ice cream versus custard. That's next. Listen, let me tell you something. With custard, the things you can do with custard that you can't do with ice cream. I'm telling you now. Yeah. On to the next door. Did he drop the spoon on us? Mm-hmm. I did. Hey, hey, Florida, make sure when you run that back, make sure you make sure that effect is loud. Oh, bro, I got some. I've been learning how to work my uh, my uh, video stuff. Yeah, bro, I'm, I'm, I'm. This video is gonna be so fire. I'm yeah. gonna tell you right now. I got some stuff. I'm gonna add some effects, all that. But I digress. But so anyway, uh, ladies. So Quita says she need a beta. Kita says she need an alpha. So I'm gonna switch the question up. What is it about a beta that doesn't just get you going? Because I don't think we, I don't think Perk heard what you said, uh, Kita. I can tell you what she said. Oh, go ahead. Come say? on. Let, let's, let's hear it, Perk. Let's hear it. Oh, Kia or I already know what Quita means. My aunt. My aunt. My aunt. <laughs> I mean, she just looked like she's just a no nonsense, but she gonna joke the hell out you. And and the last time we talked, she said a couple things like in her first date, like he didn't do a couple things, and she was already like, "Yeah, this ain't gonna work." I mean, so she <laughs> she she pretty much got that same face, like she don't really have no face reaction. But like, if you come in there and you can change the the environment, she cool with it. But if you can't, it's like, yeah, I'm gonna run over you. Uh, you probably gonna pay for every meal. All that, yeah. <laughs> so with the beta, I just can't. I don't want anybody. I could just. I mean, I understand, like you said, betas. They are not bad dudes, but they are just gonna. Everyone that I've come in contact with, it's like I just ran all over them, and I don't need it. I want a man to be a man. If I'm wrong, tell me I'm wrong. Hey, you wrong. Don't be afraid. Yeah, baby, okay. No, I don't want that. I feel like a beta could do that. Like, he could tell you where you're wrong, but, like, Mm -mm. what we talking about? You don't think so? That's that's a bought lesson. Like, he would have to learn that lesson. He's not... Yeah, like he... Beta is second in command. Like, they, they're not trying to... You could, you could teach him these talents. No, I'm going to tell him what's up. Dog. You could teach dogs tricks, too. I'm going to be the big dog in the relationship, basically. Yeah. So, Florida, you wouldn't tell a chick where she's wrong? Like, you wouldn't say she's wrong? Hey, hold on, hold on, pause, pause. Hold on, pause, pause. So, since you said that, I got to I gotta say this. So, <laughs> Florida going to laugh. So I tried to Florida Florida want to talk to somebody. You want me to tell your story? Oh, go ahead. I mean, I, anything right. about me? So, I'm cool with so, so Florida, uh, Florida was interested in this chick, right? And so I tried to hook Florida up. You know, like I'm a good negotiator. Uh, oh, I be kind of I be kind of getting messed around when I get negotiated. So the chick basically said, which was like total opposite of him, was like, and, and this was Florida like trying to feel her out. She was like, for she basically said Florida was a beta. And I was like, bro, if you you really don't know who you talking about right now. She was like, no, because he said he was gonna do this and he didn't do this. And I said, so what did you do though? Like, did you did you see what he asked you to see? Did you do anything? She was like, Well, I, I don't know uh, what he was gonna do, but I need a man who's gonna tell me that. I said, mm, okay. That sounds so good right now. But if a man asks you what you want and you don't tell him, that says a lot to me, though. Because most men, when they first meet you, they're trying to figure out um, who you are, what you want to do. Because mm-hmm. most men could come in and be aggressive. And then the first thing you're going to say is, oh, he aggressive. And like even mm-hmm. the other women at the table was kind of like, OK, Perk, I feel what you're saying. I'm like, I'm just saying, like, when you first meet somebody and especially when when you really like somebody and you really want to talk to them, you're, you're going to send your representative. And your representative is yourself, but it's it's a quiet person. It's more like, 
I'm gonna go with the flow. I'm gonna move slow. I'm a, I'm gonna be real nice. But as soon as like you open up a door, like for me, because I and I said this, and we was in a restaurant. I said this, like if as soon as a girl fart, it's over with. Like you have just opened up the gate. Like it's over. We <laughs> gangsters it. right now. Like everything coming out. Like if you if you stay, I'm gonna tell you. If I don't want to eat that, I'm gonna tell you. If I don't go there, I'm gonna tell you. Like yeah, if you fart, like I can't trust a woman who can't fart. I'm sorry. She had. <laughs> Yeah, and to, uh, to add to that, the chick he talking about, um, it was on and off, but it's just that she was in one spot, I'm here, so it's like, yeah, yeah, and I was just, it just, yeah, I know if I was more closer that way to, or even if I was in Louisiana, it would probably pop off better than me being here in Florida. But back to your question, uh, Quita, what you said? So you wouldn't tell her where she's wrong? Yeah, now I'd be probably be an asshole about it too. Mm-hmm. I mean, think about what he said about the about the perfume though. <laughs> but it was making him itch. It, 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 so it don't matter. He, that's still who he is. Like that <laughs> thing is not listen for the first 15 days, you're gonna have a nice Florida. After 15 days, and y'all start really talking, it's over with. Like you gonna really <laughs> be like, I like that nigga, or I don't like him. Oh, what I he said about the fupa. It's his dry humor. But 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 that's my thing though. Like she she was she really had some security issues with herself and uh insecure issues with herself. I said security. She really has hey, issues. We, we gotta herself. run the fupa back. <laughs> she has some real insecure issues with herself. And my thing is this though, for a man to tell you that and want to help you with that, that says a lot. Like most men would be like, like, I ain't gonna lie to you. If you got a big food, but I'm not really trying to help you with your food because I feel like this one thing. If I'm fat, you can't be fat. We both can't be fat. We just can't. That's just too much heat in, in, in the bedroom. Too much. And then there's certain things I just can't do with you. Like, we can't try these different positions. We got one way to go. <laughs> I'm, just being honest. I'm sorry. We can't do it. I, I see yeah, yeah. none of that. I, I cannot way. stand y'all, bro. This is, like, well, we know you got a weight limit. You've already said that you have a weight limit. I so. do. Listen, let me tell you something. You, I'm talking you Florida. Be bigger than me. Eight or two. I, Why I you say? Mine. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Florida weight limit might be a little bit more than mine because see, he do push ups every day, and, <laughs> and he got a little more muscular to me. I can't do that extra stuff. Mm-mm. I can't. Like me, the way I I don't have a weight limit. I have a certain um, how your body look. Like I I can't do the sack of potatoes. I'm sorry. Mm-mm. Better it better be some like you can have a big stomach, but it better be bigger in the back. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. That is a turn off. Mm-mm. It ain't <laughs> enough alcohol in y'all state to make me do it. <laughs> I, I mean, hold on, hold on, hold on. And since we here, the uh, ladies, ladies. I mean, y'all not just to date anybody if a dude look a certain way. I don't care how hey, much she got on. I got a question for him. I got a question for him because this new coming out. I don't. So I, don't know. I went to I went to Louisiana to get a haircut this weekend. Um, on my way to the crib, and so some of these dudes out here are getting these veneer teeth in. Is teeth that big important to where you got to get your teeth cut, shaved down? And then they put these veneer implants in. Like, is it that serious right now? I not for me. It's not. As long as it doesn't look like you chew pills, then I'm usually okay. A but. big chiclet teeth. Uh-uh. Okay. But I think it's everybody following the trend. Um, That's what it is. Man, let me tell y'all something. They told me it costs more than ten thousand dollars. I told them this, man. Yeah. Look, I'm trying to get my teeth whitened. That's about it, bro. I was looking at the uh, Invisalign, but when that lady told me that, I said, look, you want to wait a year until I get my full insurance on here for you to do all that. Uh-uh. Mm-hmm. But I mean, the people that get in the veneers, I mean, if they're getting the veneers, obviously they teeth probably in pretty bad shape to the point where they can't just go to the dentist to get the braces and stuff to fix no, it. But so my thing is, but you're not taking care of your regular teeth, what makes you think you're going to take care of the veneers? But, like, isn't it more expensive? Yeah. Then braces? Yes. 
it's cheaper just to go get braces. Exactly. So yeah. like, say, okay, say for instance, your teeth just crooked, you probably need an Invisalign or um, braces that can fix it. These people, they teeth decaying and they got all this other these other issues, so they get it shaved down, get the porcelain veneers on. But my thing is, you still have to take care of your teeth. You didn't take care of your regular teeth. Now you finna get this shaved down, and you got all that infection and everything up underneath all the other stuff. Expensive teeth. Like your mouth still stains. So, question: Do the veneers stay on or they pop out? No, they stay on. Just stay on. It should be permanent. <clears throat> but you gotta go back for like. She a made me read. She made me rethink about it because she said when you got all that infection under there, I'm like, oh, that's just nasty. <laughs> you gotta think of, that's what you got to think about. The only thing they're doing is they're shaving the teeth down and basically cementing this porcelain on your teeth. You still got all that rotten shit up underneath them veneers. <clears throat> all this is, is it cement or is it screwing? It's the cement. So, Because they told me there's two ways you can do it. They do the cement if you got missing teeth and they put the thing in your mouth and it's like they screw it on if you have missing teeth because they have nothing to attach it to. Uh, right. That yeah. metal screw. My nigga, I ain't gonna lie to you. Me and that came up in 2020, but we didn't we didn't start getting these hairdos. Now we getting the new teeth. Golly. Yeah, I ain't doing none of that. I, I had two boys. All that stuff sounds like it hurt. Man. Man, it hurt, man. Anything over ten thousand dollars like that. I mean, if you ain't in the public eye like that, yeah, bro, stop that, man. Yeah, I'm that's, that's the Just people. Take you know. care of your teeth. That's yeah. I'm good. Brush them. I'm good. Yeah, brush them. I had talked to the, one girl, this lady I knew about the dentist. She was like, "Look, hurt. Your teeth ain't that bad." You just need to go get a cleaning. You probably need to get a couple fillings, get some little things around the top. And you probably need to do them them crest whitening strips and call it a day. Okay, cool. Mm-hmm. And I'm not going no further. When they start talking about ten thousand dollars, I'm like, oh no. Not for me. Well, I mean, as as Mr. Samuel said, if you got that inch, you ain't gotta do a whole lot of that. <laughs> <laughs> well, we don't have any proof. Hey, I ain't had no uh I ain't heard no uh problems. Oh, okay. I ain't, I ain't got to that point in my life where I got to change something. Nah, mm-mm. I think I'm good. Yeah. yeah. Uh-uh. But that was some uh, interesting news right there. Didn't know that was popping off, and, and especially <laughs> in Louisiana. Yeah, man. They getting them, you know they getting them PPP loans, man, and all of them finna go to jail with veneers. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody going to jail with veneers. They going to jail with veneers and what is it? The BBLs. Hey, all I'm saying is they gonna be they teeth gonna be pretty in there for somebody <laughs> That is not gonna be what it do. Lord. So um dealing with it, let me let me ask you, let me ask you, uh, y'all three this question. Well let, y'all two. Well, part you too, because you you get in the boat too. What are three characteristics you are looking to see if a, a man's a well, let me tell you, Perk, out of, if a man's an alpha or a beta? Are there three things By you're the, looking for? The way he approaches you, you can usually tell. Like most betas are not gonna look you in your eyes. Like <laughs> they talk to you and they're like, they'll hand you their like at work, they'll hand me their money and they like look off or you know, I be trying to make conversation. It'd be awkward, it's very awkward. Now, alphas, they're usually aggressive, like very aggressive. How is it aggressive if you are alpha? Like, let me, let's go with that. Like, al- like a lot of alphas that come at me, it's just like, they're like. See, that's, that's not being aggressive, name? though. That's not being aggressive. Oh, that's no, being no. Aggressive. That's being I can't, aggressive. I'm not going to. Well, that's okay. Being we, aggressive. That's we can being say, aggressive. See, my thing we can is, say up front. I'm going to say it's being case. straightforward. Thank you. We can, we can say right. straightforward. Okay, they're very straightforward. Let me say that. Um, a lot of alphas they're very consistent. Um, I'm consistent. Hold on. <laughs> so no, no, no. So what she trying to make it seem like, like, like people ain't consistent. Like, first of all, you ain't finna put no beta in alpha clothing and think that beta ain't gonna show up at some point. As they say, you could put a wolf in sheep clothing. No, nah. 
That ain't gonna happen because that's they gonna they gonna show their true colors after a while. No, nah, but some of Quita Quita stuff is like I I'm because I, I okay before you got on perk, I, I I it was your first it was just me and uh, my aunt then Quita got on so I just asked her what do you think I am an alpha or beta and they were like well what you think is I said beta, but the stuff she's still saying Quita make you I'm like alpha. I yeah like I'm looking and when I'm when I'm go out I see a woman I look at that in her eye. I might look down, but I'm gonna look back up. <laughs> this this your homeboy talking to you, bro. You've been an alpha all your life. Uh-oh. From the day you started talking in Grambling, and you was an alpha. Let me just okay. say. Okay, I've never got that from him. Okay. Nigga, listen, the nigga ain't stopped talking since he started talking at the party. I blame Pat. We need to invite no. We need to invite Pat on here with you, Nick. Let me see if I can get Pat on. Hold on, but look, 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 look. I, no, 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 part, part, look. I was the same way with her because she did my hair for a while and she thought I was mute. I thought he was retarded. Everybody like, say mute. No, I'm like, I'm so serious. Like, I did, I started doing his hair, I'm going to say, how many fall, years? Th- fall, fall, no, excuse me, summer 2000, summer 2008, because I got your number from JT. So I'm doing his hair. I used to sit like he would literally sit there and would not say a word because I'm tender because I'm tender headed. When I get my hair done, I go to sleep. It helps. Like I'm asking him something, he's shaking his head. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, I'm tender headed. Mm-hmm. I'm tender headed. Like bro, when I get my head. like he wouldn't bro. say nothing. What you got going? What up, Pat? I'm in the club right now. What's going on? Now you won't shut up. You own the clubhouse. Man, I was gonna try to get you on so we could talk to Pat, uh, Florida Uncle about this mute. I right. stop talking. He right. talk. I know she got the Cleo braids, but that's my aunt. <laughs> These ain't Cleo braids. You better get it together. Huh? Y'all trying to give me a what? You better I'm get gonna, it together. Real quick, because his aunt on here, and she thought he was a mute too, and because he wouldn't talk <laughs> when she was doing his hair. Oh yeah. Tell him that he's a beta male. We we considered him a, a beta, like. It's my fault. I need to get on here and explain this. Yeah, yeah. Get on here and explain that, bro. Okay. Hold on. Give me, give me two seconds to make myself somewhat. Yeah, yeah. Put a hat on. Put a San Francisco hat on. I'm not putting a hat on. I don't that that nigga got a hat on. Put a Mexican wild, hat on or something. <laughs> put a, matter of fact, <laughs> matter of fact, put a do-rag on. He better yeah. not come out here. No. He better not. Put a do-rag on. Put a no. do-rag on. If he ain't got put a do-rag, do-rag, do-rag on, I'm kicking him out. You better get on, bro. To a woman right. coming on here with a bonnet. That is, I would say that's equal to a bonnet. No, nah, we, we don't. Bo- we we don't bonnet shame on this podcast. We love them all. We do not bonnet shame on this podcast. So, but anyway, she thought I was mute. Hey, but, but once again, when I get my hair done, I'm always quiet because I'm tender headed. Hey, I I thought the boy was special too though because he stayed next door to me. <laughs> So the first time I seen him, I was like, bro, you good? You know, we finna go to the cab. He was like, oh, no. Nah. I'm like, but we got in the car like, Cuz, what the fuck is this shit gonna be like for us? <laughs> nigga. So, you know, a couple days go by. Nigga see the nigga again. Nigga walking this time. It was hot as hell. Hey, we stopped by the nigga. Cuz, you want to ride? Nigga got in the car. Now he got in the car. Oh, he got in? Yeah, we went to eat. And uh, he ain't talked for a while, you know. Then Pat took him to some party. The nigga came back talking, nigga. Like the whole when they first got when we first got back up, I think it was me star. I don't know if it was star there or not. I think it was. Nah, he wasn't there. It, it was, was I, Who was? It was you. This this is the original H S. You, um, Carl. Carl was there. Uh, Pat roommate at the time. What's up, boy? Name from Shreve- Mo from Shreveport. Um, Vale, Rob, JB, Jared. Okay. Um, yeah, because we was all at Pat House that Friday. Bro, when I took no, no, we talking about outside when we met up outside on the yard. Oh, on the yard, it was it was you and somebody else. It was another nigga. So, I don't know who it was. So we they pull up outside, right? And hold on. It's the it's the same HS though. Um, the uh, the yeah, uh, looking to group me. Looking to group. You said looking to group me. It's 
probably so far in the group me. Man, scroll up. It's on Zoom, right? Yeah. It's on Zoom. Quita, stay on your screen. <laughs> She's excited. She yeah. is excited to see you. No, for like literally, I'm trying to have a full right. blown conversation with uh, with, uh, with Keita. When Perk at? When Perk at? We said we're going to go two weeks without checking on Perk. Like, I ain't got so thing. mad that ain't nobody talking to you. What's so, Perk? Where Perk at? Where Perk so, at? So, so, Lakia, we get on, we we like, them niggas pull up and they, he's, he start talking, past start talking. So I'm sitting there like, And as he talking, I'm just listening. Like for ten minutes, he talked. I was like, I was like, bro, I don't mean to apologize. My bad. But when did this nigga start talking though? What happened at the party that he made him start talking? Brandy. Listen. Ever since then, the nigga won't shut up. Did you say Brandy? Who is Brandy? The liquor, Brandy. Uh -oh. oh. You actually had a drink. I never seen Brandy before. And I seen it with like on every the time Titanic. Drunk, every time he drank, that's what that's candy. It was it was uh, they they talked about brandy because you, you only rich people, rich white people drink brandy. Here it is on Grambling camp, uh, campus, not the cheap stuff, the real brandy. I said I gotta try it. Oh. So that, that's how that situation happened. And ever since then, he been talking. And, and he done messed up two or three of my relationships. Messed up one. I mean, he messed up two. Well, I still, I bring him around people and he just sit there and look crazy and embarrass me. <laughs> That's because he don't know him. See, the other thing is, if he don't know him, he ain't going to say nothing because he know one thing. He'll say something and offend anybody quick. But he know I'm going to take up for him. I ain't going to let all that go. He just sit there. He used to wouldn't take oh. pictures either. If he would take pictures, his hair would be over his face, like the grudge. It's he, crazy. I, I, I'm telling you this. You're not going to say nothing because I'm telling you. He'll say something to offend them for quick. Like quick, quick. Plus, plus the, the what she brought me around a uh, little man. He was trying to get what, and he thought I was blocking. I didn't dude. want him. The little dude that wanted him? Yeah. Oh, he was being an asshole then because he said. No, no, no. I was quiet. I'm not quiet. Like, oh, he can show me shit. I'm like, like, no. I, I started smoking my cigar. I started smoking my cigar because I'm like, I don't want this dude to think I'm blocking. Like, no, this is my aunt. Shoot your shot. <laughs> I did not want him. And you little knew. Man was a, little man. Yeah, hey, what's that? Are you all? What up? What up? What up? What up? Hello. Now, so, I gotta tell a real story because okay, first, hold on, probably, Pat. Hold on, hold on, Pat. That, that's my aunt. that's fine. Hello, aunt. How you doing? Hey, we we finna tell you the truth about why he's not quiet anymore. Okay. Uh, so wait, hold on. How much of the how, how much story have you have you gotten? What have y'all told Perk, already? Perk told his part about the party and when I came back from it, but you can tell it from where you want to start. The floor is yours, Patrick. I'm going to start with the party. Shoot your shot. So, all right. So, first of all, we also thought that Florida was deaf and mute and didn't really say much because he would just sit off to the side and, and collect money. That's what he would do. Occasionally get up and hit somebody and then me and then we end up having a fight, but we're not going to go there. We're not talking about that today. So, we at this party. Florida also does wasn't drinking at the time. He has a drink and proceeds to lose his mind. The whole night yelling. I would yell and I'll let him tell that because, uh, yeah, to protect the innocent, I'm going to let him tell what he was yelling. You want to you interject here, Florida, with what you was? Oh, I'm telling Q, pull it out, let him know where he's from. There was a young it was, lady. It was a young lady looking at Q D. And she was like, I just can't stop looking at his dick. I can't stop looking. So I'm like, she a cute. Pull it out. Let her know where you from. Because he's from New Orleans. But as so you were, the, Pat. So the entire night, Florida is, pull it out. Tell her where you pull from, Q. You from, Q. Tell pull her where you out. from, Q. The whole night. Pull it out. Florida ain't shut up since. Pull it out. 
Wow. Literally has not shut up since. Oh so, you know what? <laughs> so, hey, 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 Auntie, I'm going to tell you the best way to get him is to give him some water, but put a little drink, put a little spike in there. <laughs> like, Listen, I will take I responsibility. I have a drink with me so many times he refuses. No, no, no. You got to have a good reason. Yeah, I will take responsibility for getting him out of his shell, but he got to take responsibility for all the lives that he has ruined since he's been out of his shell. <laughs> okay, he has you, ruined okay. Some lives. how on, did you so, get him to go? Um, <laughs> not for no, Ford would always be down to go somewhere. He he would he might always kind of just chill. Plus, yeah, because I was I was new to Graham. I didn't know nobody, so I'm like. I'm hanging with two dudes who actually, like, when they walk, people yell their name. Yeah, I'm finna go. Where, where we going? All right. Yeah, it's a house. It's a it's a uh, a dorm party. I'm I'm down. It's it's Tuesday. It's grambling. Like like I told Quita, anything it's can go always, down during the week. It's grambling. Thank you. Nah, yeah. One thing I say, Flood Flo was always down to go. Though, if you needed somebody to ride with you somewhere, that's that man right there. But he would do it quietly, and then he had a drink that night. And- okay. Like okay, I said, he so, ain't shut up since. Hold on, hold on. So this, the, the light skin guy said, I don't really true relationship. One of them is it's like an equal opportunity for all three of us. <laughs> <laughs> so can we count her as a relationship? Wait, wait, no, it wait. was a relation. It was a relationship, but that was like all three of us. Mostly, I, I'm gonna say I'm gonna take forty percent. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I'm out. <laughs> and, look, and look, and look, my 40% happened on uh, one night. That's when my 40% jumped in on one night. Listen, I, I, I have never no, no, felt more, one, I have ahead. never had my life feel more threatened. Three than grown by, ass men. Three grown ass men scared the, of one. Than by one of Perks' relationships. We're gonna we not oh. gonna say names to protect the innocent. Yeah, but I'm gonna say the crazy girl. Well, hold on, they all be crazy. They're they all crazy. Yeah, you don't even know what we're talking about. They all crazy. Yeah, you know. oh, I thought this is the, thought this is the one that y'all was scared to go in the house. Let me no, no, this oh, yeah. is definitely that one. This is definitely that one. But look, let me give so, a disclaimer. No, no, no hold on. Now. You can give your disclaimer. I have hold had on. some bad relationships. Hey, mute him. Don't let, him. don't let him talk. I've <laughs> had traumatic <laughs> relationships. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Florida. We have been a part of his traumatic relationship. Yes. <laughs> Hey, Lord. you can't mute me, goddammit. Look, man, and the sad part about it, it was during the holiday season. <laughs> hey, hold on. Hey, you got to chill. Hey, you got to chill. We, we, we're protecting the innocent. We but, anyway. the incident, but it was during the holiday season. So, <laughs> Who is the innocent? So Y'all are her. <laughs> Shit, her. No, us. Yeah, actually, yeah. Actually, us. Actually, us. Exactly so, us. we protect the guilty. We're not naming no names. Yeah, exactly um, us. We don't know what the statute of limitations is. So if we don't know where she we, at. If we don't know where she at. She we, could be in Cali. She could be in Oklahoma. She could be in Florida. Hey, was we, was we going? Were we going back for the money for the money box? Is that what we was going back? Yeah, for? yeah. Okay. yeah. Cool. I just want to make sure I'm telling this accurately. Where he was so, at when we? Dang, he should have been on the episode. So yeah, y'all don't fuck with me, but it's cool. Uh, we really don't. So <laughs> we no, go back. To you Perk better Island. not say that because you've been in this shitless circuit softball tournament. And we just be letting you live, boy. You better stop. First of all, first of all, um, I'm coming off this championship, so you're gonna put some respect on my softball Ooh, activity. Man, oh, excuse excuse me. Excuse me. Congratulations. Uh, walk, Congratulations. Walk, walk off game. And uh, to, to y'all beat uh Lutch and uh Club. Yeah, until y'all be fat. So, <laughs> y'all just, the, y'all just the Western Conference champion. Until y'all be fat. Y'all just the first Western all, Conference champion. First of all, let me tell you something but, about Eddie Brown. But go ahead with uh-huh. your story though, because we, we nah, have no time. I ain't Not no too much on fat. Not too much. I ain't gonna take no shot. Hold on. Go ahead. No, no. Relax. T- 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 relax. Relax. Heard now. relax. Yeah. Yeah. But anyway, so damn, I forgot where I was going with that. Where was it? Money, money, money box. You was at the money box. Bam. Money box. There we go. Focus. Focus. Got to bring me back. Focus. All right. So we on our way back to campus to get this money box. Perk don't want to go to the house by itself, so he asked us to come with him. He didn't tell us at first that he was scared to go back to the house by itself. He just told us that he wanted us to ride with him. So we thinking that she gone. They didn't got into it. She usually go away for a little while when they get into it. We walking up the stairs laughing. Man, what is she in there? We open the door. Oh, she ain't here. 
nigga hit the light. The light. <laughs> She's sitting on this couch. The face was necessary. She's sitting on the couch in the dark. This dark red lipstick on. Got on something totally different than when we left. There is a knife and a jar of Kool-Aid sitting there. Listen, not a regular knife. Not like it's 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 a carving knife. With the edges on it. With yeah. the edges hey, on hey, it. Let me, let, me it. It. let me paint it. Let me paint it. Let me so, paint it better. It's like a movie. You know how you be talking and you be like, man, we ain't even gonna have to go in there. We ain't even gonna have to go in there. Man, they ain't in there. And then as soon as you open the door, it's like all y'all standing there looking and the camera look at all three of y'all at the same time. Yeah, it was like it was like right there, like, yeah, we ain't going in there, don't open up, boom. Oh, okay. Flower flowers scattered on the ground that perk bought papers, knife. Be, that, that morning it was the it was the rest of the flyers in one big pile cut up. That that morning her hair was red, that night it was black. <laughs> Yo, I forgot about the hair. I Sir, <laughs> Bishop, look now, you 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 see all three of us, right? Picture all three of us real tight walking the park room just to get a money. Like, you know how they did no. on uh on Scooby when they be scared, they tighten up together. <laughs> that, was, that was that was three grown ass men, right? Yeah, that was it. Was us. it was it was for sure like. Then we sit there, Perk talking about, Perk talking about, we, we in Perk room whispering. She still ain't said nothing. She said nothing. So we come in, walk past her, go in Perk room. I drew, we she, whisper, can, Yo. she can hear us. <laughs> right. In the room. The walls, the walls, the walls are about as thin as a piece, it's literally a piece of paper wall. We in Drew Hall, uh, 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 Keita, we in Drew Hall when this went down. Yeah. Um, I had a comment, but I'm going to keep it to myself uh, to protect the guilty in this one. Um, yeah. Anyway, so we in there. Okay, so why is she just sitting out there? <laughs> what the is going on? We trying to figure out where Perk gonna stay that night because Perk cannot go back home after, back. after the party. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we, we, yeah, we, we would have been victims to a murder. Yeah, man, listen, that was the most scary shit of my life. All because Perk wanted going to break that iPhone. Back he paid for. Uh, all, all because Perk wanted to pay, for, wanted to break that iPhone. He paid for. What did you say? Yeah. What? Who walked out of the room first, though? It hurt. <laughs> it, it was, it was, it was for discussion, but I got pushed out first. And so when I got pushed first, out, of all, first of all, let me say something. It should have never been a discussion. Out, I took out to the door, and next thing I know, it was it was like a train running. It should have <laughs> never been a discussion. Queen, hey. when we got outside, we act so hard. <laughs> we ain't scared. <laughs> Shit, I don't know, but I'm mean, hey. I ran to the car. I ran to the car. Hey. Like them niggas came. Look, look now. I, I look. I just got the gram. Like, I'm literally like six foot one, one seventy three, soaking wet. I'm, I'm around these niggas right here. I'm like, dog. It, it's no way. If anything go down, she gonna have to catch me. We, we talked about hey, this. You know the rule. Just, you know the rule. Don't be last for the next two months. And we talked about this while we was counting money that night. Like, that shit was so fucking scary. So, what, so how long did it take you to go back home? I went home. I ain't gonna tell you what happened when I went home. <laughs> we, 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 we was outside to about four in the morning. Wait, the door? It, 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 yeah, yeah, it was no I, look. It was no it, alpha or beta males that night. I can guarantee you that. Nah, we we was <laughs> we was straight, we was straight in the parking lot. Like. Hey man, listen. <laughs> Wasn't nobody from the. Uh, I wasn't. I, I still had things to do, man. I couldn't. I wasn't ready to die. Still had uh, things to accomplish in this life. That 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 was some. That that was for hey, the books. For the record, we never talked about this, but it's no way that she didn't hear us running down them steps because it was the loudest steps in the world. <laughs> she had to hear us hit them steps. Bruh. Bruh. So. Bruh. Yeah. Well. Appreciate you getting on, Pat. What you, what you about to do? Oh yeah, hey, hey so yeah, I'll be easy. I know when I, I know when my presence is not wanted. I'm gonna holler at y'all. I always want you, Pat, on the podcast. Pat, hey, thank Pat you for clarifying that because because Pat can't sneak out like he wants to, and Florida just put him on blast. That's what that is. Oh, Pat can get off of you. Pat, it's a lead button right here. We know, we know. 
We got you. Florida, just, Florida just beat you to the punch today. For sure. <laughs> I appreciate you, my dog. We, we'll, get you, we'll get you back on for a Quita episode. <laughs> Lord. We're not doing another Quita at episode. New, at Nuvo. <laughs> now nah, I got to be uh, Five Star Fridays. That's true. That is true. That is true. They, they, they got to be, be Five Star Fridays. At O'Charlie's? Huh? Yeah, definitely O'Charlie's Five Star Fridays. Only been to a Five Star Friday once. Lies. Once. And I took pictures Lies. with Florida and Star. You know, I forgot Lies. about it. I, I was at Nouveau every weekend, but not the five star. I went to the, the stoplight party. Everybody was at Nouveau every weekend. Hey, was that that? Man, yeah. All right, fellas, we got to end this up because uh, Quita got a, uh, Quita got a teach in the morning. She's still a teacher, even oh. though she on her, her hot girl, thought girl shit. You in summer school, baby? Yes. She got to teach the babies. She's making that money then. Mm-hmm. They get that bread in the summertime. Y'all be easy. Auntie, it was nice meeting you. Nice meeting you also. I'm going to holla at y'all. Yeah. yeah, so that's that's that story. It, it took a turn for the tale, but that, that, that still is a scary movie that probably going to be a movie sooner or later. I think Pat is an alpha male. No? He's, he's, a, he, he's an asshole. Man. He's an asshole. <laughs> I, mean, I, I mean, y'all have to tell me. I, I don't judge. So, well, Queen, what you think I am? Like, you already know what the fuck you are. Don't even. What? Am I a beta? Like, we would probably stay into it. No, we wouldn't. See, that's you, the- we would. That between the difference between your betas and alpha. I'm gonna see in the lead. I ain't finna keep repeating myself. Ooh. <laughs> All right. Oh. I got a couple questions for my aunt, and then we'll wrap this up. So he'll keep repeating himself. Yeah. So I'm first keep question. Go ahead, yeah. go ahead, Slater. Go ahead. All right. All right. So first question first. Are you an alpha or a beta female? I would say alpha. Alpha. All right. Um, uh, how can I put this? Um, have you been to Whataburger and tried their pancakes before? <laughs> <laughs> I've never had Whataburger before. Have you had Cracker Bear? Mm, yeah, I have. Have you had the pancakes at Cracker Barrel? Should think no. about the no, because you're oh, oh, okay. We, we eat, we eat. So, we eat. so, so, can you do us a favor and try both? Both. At one point. Matter of fact, matter, no, 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 it's not. So, matter of fact, now this is gonna be the setup. Take the little short dude and tell him you want to go to Cracker. <laughs> No, nah, she got gonna Jacksonville for that one because he live up here with me. Yeah, you could try to you could try to Whataburger pancakes on your own at, at, at any given time. <laughs> <laughs> right. Next question, Florida. All right, favorite uh, place of vacation. Um, that I've been already. Gonna say Hawaii. No, we're not been already. If you had to pick your favorite place to vacation, Hawaii, Paris, Miami, Vegas, up to you. Um, Why you know? Go. I'm trying to get to Africa. Mm. What was so good about uh, Hawaii? Um, with me, I just love water and a good scene, and I got both of those there. Like waking up to a beautiful view and water every morning. She got a she got a thirst trap pick for you. Really? Let us see. I can't do that. I cannot with you. Hold on, nigga. You got picks now because anybody else you'll put them out. You ain't gonna put her out. That's my aunt, man. You can. I don't care. That's why I like his aunt. Now, anybody else, you'll put him out, but but your aunt, you want to Because he has it saved in his phone, and y'all probably seen it. He uses it as a meme all the time. 
what? Hey, some question. Was was the people out there good? They were. They were. They were very friendly. Um did you find did you go out there and get Stella got a groove back? No. <laughs> no, no, no. She definitely can do that. I did not. They have some taller men since you don't like the short man. They actually they um the men over there, they they were taller. Um I don't like a skinny man um mm. at all. They had get a chance. Long. Huh? Say perk has a chance. That's that's for <laughs> he's booed up. Oh, I'm sorry, Boo. Sorry, Boo. We're here. We was just playing. You are not paying attention. I said she on the hot girl, thought hey, girl. Let me tell you something about Queen, boy. I don't <laughs> care. <laughs> Coach, you ain't Coach. got your stuff secure. Queen will tear it down. You hear me? Like, she would call out the person in the background. They messing with the lights. Perk, your hand right there. Who messing with the lights? Like, Queen. <laughs> like, why is you worried about what's going on over here? You done got your little gold background back, and now you just won't look at what everybody else got going. Uh uh, don't do that. Uh huh. Can't. Oh my gosh, I just, I just said she on hey. hot girl, hot girl. Shit. Hey, I got a question. I got a question. Somebody messing it's with alpha. <laughs> it be <laughs> perky be having shit going on. Okay, so That's can funny. a beta be an alpha in the bedroom? What the fuck? Oh, this is Florida. Yes! Ooh. That was not from Hawaii, though. Yes! That's from the Bahamas, fool. It say goodbye. I didn't say where it was from. I said she got a, a, a She got a pick. thirst trap pick. Yes, honey. She out there thugging. Florida don't show us nothing we ain't supposed to see now. Okay. Oh, you want to see something? I can show you something. No. Mm -mm. Anyway, go, go ahead. Ask your question because we got to get off. Can a beta be an alpha in the bedroom? Yes. Um, yes? What do you think? You think a no? Wait, what? <laughs> I don't Is it no so. for you? I don't think so. I think so. Two different positions. Mm. He still want to please, so he gonna. If you gonna, if you a pleaser, you gonna please regardless, regardless of your position. Okay. So I just see me taking on. You see it? Oh. You you said, give me I just see me taking over. <laughs> Like you not gonna give him a chance. I mean, cause I'm I just I've never I, I just don't see it. I just can't She done had too many bad experiences. Mm. That so for her a beta a beta can't even sniff it. <laughs> it won't even go. I mean it has never went that far. Cause I mean I just because it's a beta. I've been turned off. Yeah. Yeah. Florida, your, your auntie. I don't know. Oh, right. I know. You know, I know. Trust me. <laughs> but here, let me let me put it like this. Um, since we talking one of Quita questions, when she do her thing, they do they do come back. They try their best. Mm. They try their best. Hey, she just put her head down like he went too far. See? So she bruh, got that comeback. Yeah, bro, it's one dude right now happily married. Still oh. trying. Mm. Hopefully he don't watch the podcast. I hope he do. Because I'm like, dog, ch stop. <laughs> like, she don't, like, she don't block your number. Oh. And then you find another number. And then you find another way to still get in contact with her. I'm that man mm. resourceful. That man is resourceful. Oh, and and, and you know what the crazy part about this? And I'm gonna tell you this once we get off, and once she get off, uh, um, you know the chick you was talking about about in Dallas? Me? Yeah. Uh huh. You remember the one that said you 
thought I was a pushover. Yeah. Uh, messed around with her while talking to her. Hmm? Huh? Fresh this thing out. Let's go back. Let's yeah. go to behind the scenes. Yeah, yeah. I gotta go. Here. I gotta go. Yeah, yeah. So that that's 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 yeah. So that's a whole other stuff. But anyway, last question. Uh, 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 um, quick, uh, Kita, and then we done. Um, what is one of the most? Hold on. Let me make sure I get. No, ask that. No, I'm even ask that one. We even ask that one. Um, what have you been most impressed about with the Cal podcast? Um. We're ending on that one. I'm gonna say the consistency. Like, um, mm. y'all didn't stop. Y'all kept going. I mean, I know, like, I've heard how um, Florida has told me, like, sometimes you try to get people, they don't come through. Um, but you guys are still consistent with it. You're not letting anything stop you. Um, so I'm gonna just say the consistency. Um, for me, because what y'all on season two now? Yeah. And I've seen how it has grown. Um, hell, I hardly even talk to him anymore because of the podcast, because he always busy doing something. So. Can you talk to him more? Because I'll be zoomed out sometimes. <laughs> set, up, set up meeting dates or something. Anyways, mm-hmm. so to my favorite aunt, Thank you for getting back on for the Cal Podcast. We really appreciate that. Uh, no you got anything you want? Anything you want to promote? IG, what you got going on? This is your time to shine. The floor is yours. No, just thanks for having me. That's it. Quita, you got anything? I don't. Perk. Uh, man, it's good. Um, I was out last week. Um, I had fun. I definitely uh, had fun coming back. Glad the feedback. Uh, got me a new setup where I'm comfortable, so I'm good. Well, this is our uh, Alpha Beta Meta series. Uh, excuse me, Alpha Beta Male series. We're gonna be rocking this throughout the whole month of July. Uh, next week, we got uh, Team Light Skin will be in the building, so TJ will be back on, and we're gonna keep this thing rolling. Uh, I gotta get with Avery and Sabrina. I'm gonna try to get with one more of the female and then uh, bring your girl from there. Who? Bring your girl that was on that back. I don't think she was a good conversation because she was just really just there for the ride. Valerie. You talking about who? You talking about Valerie? No. Marion? Marion. Oh, yeah, I gotta reach out to Marion. Uh, damn, I'm glad you brought it up because I really forgot to reach out back out to her, but we're oh. gonna get them going. And you need so, to bring uh, Chastity. Chastity, definitely chastity. She would be, uh, uh, she would be a good one for Alpha Male and Bale. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, we'll get all them people on. Uh, like I said, we always going to do better. We're going to get better. That's Quita. That's Perk. That's my favorite aunt. Thank you all for rocking out with the Cal Podcast. G14 classified. That's good. DJ Star. Hello, world. HSCT, you know how we do.